The city of San Jose is getting ready to clear out a large encampment at Columbus Park. That's north of downtown. Many of the RVs parked there at the scene pulled up just days ago after being cleared from another nearby encampment. KTV South Bay reporter LaMonica Peters has more on where they will go from here. I believe Friday they're going to come through and they're going to come and pick up what's not running. San Jose City officials say there are about 140 vehicles currently inoperable in Columbus Park. Some people living there say they're trying to figure out where they'll go once the encampment is cleared. This is home to home. Patricia Gonzalez says she's been unhoused since 2019 and has been living in this RV at the park. Well, I'm just trying to see if I can get somebody to help me. And if not, you know, I don't know what's going to happen. They might just get towed. Gonzalez says her RV isn't operating and she's hoping the city will be able to help her get it repaired so she can move it. She says if her RV gets towed, she'll sleep in her van, which she is able to drive. Others say they'll do the same. I'm separated from my child. Um, I had placed him with his stepbrother because I didn't want him living out here with me like this. Sarah Cummings says she's been living in this van for the last two months after being evicted and leaving a long-term relationship. She also says she's on a waiting list for permanent housing. I've always wanted to be on the other side helping the homeless. I didn't know I'd end up like this. You know, like it's, it's a trip how life, how tables get turned. San Jose officials say they continue to offer supportive services to encampment residents and connects them with housing and shelter opportunities. Eugene Blackwell says he's using a hotel voucher right now, but he expects permanent housing to become available soon. He says he waited for eight years. Mixed emotions. I'm happy because, you know, I finally got housing, but at the same time, sad because there's a lot of people out here that, that and well, a lot of women and children out here that really need it right now, too. So um, it's kind of mixed emotions about it. The city of San Jose says the encampment isn't safe for people to live in, and they'll start clearing people from Columbus Park on October 11th through November 18th. LaMonica Peters, KTVU Fox 2 News.